Welcome to Unconfuse Me. I'm Bill Gates. If you had one magic wish to master a subject without any studying, which would you choose? One magic wish to master a subject. I would say it would either be quantum physics or piano. <laughs> I'm embarrassed that even though I know all these computer languages and I took Latin and Greek, I don't speak any real languages other than English. So maybe if it was easy to learn and, and I could just use my wish on it, I, I might choose Chinese because I do think, you know, helping China and the U.S. get along is going to be pretty important. So I uh, said before you came, if you had a record that you wanted to bring, please share it with me. Yeah. So what we're going to play is uh, Bob Marley's Redemption Song which is, you mentioned my, my high school rock star days, you know, Redemption Song was one of the first songs that I learned on guitar. It always spoke to me. It's about bondage of many kinds, both physical and mental bondage and kind of breaking free of it. Yeah, so I'll play it. Cool. All pirates, yes, they rob I. Sold I to the merchant ships So great Minutes after they took I This is just a classic From the bottomless pit But my head So if you do a web search on Saul Khan, you might get some of this guy. <laughs> uh, so do you ever get confused with Salman Khan? I, I, I do. In fact, the early days of Khan Academy, I got letters from you know some of his fans saying, you know, I've always been in love with you, and now I didn't know you can do math <laughs> and all that. And it's funny because, you know, us South Asians like a good, you know, kind of cheesy thing. So when I went to India in 2050, actually, I saw you there. We had a, a live on like national television interview with, between the two of oh, us. Oh, you're kidding. Just by virtue of us having the same name. But, you know, I do watch more Bollywood movies than, than folks suspect. Uh-oh. Uh, you know, my, my wife grew up in Pakistan, so people think that she made me watch the Bollywood movies, but it's usually... It's actually the other way around. I'm the I'm the one that made her watch the Bollywood. So I, I you know, I, I was very aware of him. So it was kind of a fun thing to be in the same room and and you know, share the same name. Do you watch them in Hindi or English? I can understand Hindi, which I have no business understanding. My family, <laughs> our our mother tongue is Bengali. Oh, Bengali. Yeah. Oh, wow. Um, but but and your wife? My wife's mother tongue. They're originally Gujarati, but they she spoke Urdu growing up in oh, Pakistan. Wow. But I learned Hindi mainly hearing my mom gossip on the phone when I was growing up. <laughs> I was just swear, like, oh. And then Bollywood movies. That's my Hindi. And now, like, you know, a little bit, you know, Hindi and Urdu spoken is almost the same thing. So I know enough to get by. <laughs> you and I both want education to be a lot better and really for all types of students. It's an exciting time. And it seems like you've got as much energy for Khan Academy today as you did when it first got started. Yeah, I've always run optimistic. And, you know, I've always had reasonable amount of energy but yeah I, i've told the team like what's about to happen in the next few years it, it feels like we're in the middle of a science fiction book and uh you know hopefully it'll be it'll be all for good and i'm pretty hopeful well thanks for coming down thanks for being on a learning journey with me and in a cause that we both believe in thank you hopefully i've was it unconfused you yeah a yeah bit. definitely <laughs> subscribe to unconfused me wherever you listen to podcasts